Right folks, I'm at this junction point. Just passed some bikers that I met earlier. Um, mountain bikers. I don't know if they do this. Anyway, this is the entrance to the Happy Valley. Now what I remember about it last time, you didn't see any many flowers down this bit. Just one or two, right? I don't know if you can see how beautiful the trees are though. You know, this is another cathedral area, isn't it, really, of trees. And I got a feeling it was sunny. Now, when it's sunny and the blue sky's about, the pictures come out absolutely brilliantly. Um, I can see the odd speck of bluebell. And like I said, they're nearly about to wane anyway now. And I wouldn't see any if I'd left it another week. Well, I might just about see some. I'm not, I'm trying to remember the wild garlic. But all I know how gorgeous it all is here. It's a steady climb up. It's not a, f a fierce, steep climb, but of course it's very, very bumpy. This would be like a raging river when there's fierce water and rain. It'll pour off the hills each side and whoosh down there. You can see that. You can see it would be like a river here. You'd have to go up on the bank. So it's a lovely walk and I've explored more, more entrances in different ways as well. But it's not exactly what I call a cycle track and they might not really be allowed to do this. Um, I expect the hardy ones will. <sighs> the horses come down here. Yeah? You can smell the dung of the horse manure. Oh, it smells gorgeous actually. Look at this. I'd have to Look at last year's video, sir. And I would have been like really overwhelmed. And of course, when I found some flowers, it was like even better. But I could be, I could be two weeks behind this year. Because I have to replan routes now. Before it was just automatic, go back to Cheddar go down by Tiny's Farm, go to Piney Slights, go down through Cheddar Wood, walk up through the village, that's all taken away from us, unless you can drive, or you've got money to pay for a taxi. Um, they've taken away a very, very important bus for lots and lots of reasons. People like to shop in Western Supermare. People like to have, have a day out in Western Supermare from Cheddar and the other villages. They don't, you know, they're supposed to be stopping people driving. Cost of petrol's gone up. They're almost sadistic, I think, some of these councils. They say, oh, it's not our problem. It is, because look where you spend your money sometimes. Cutting down trees. People who need to go to hospital, kids going to college. It's affected the rural community a lot. Right, they've put on this ridiculous bus service, which, it's not like exactly going to Cheddar. You could end up having to do some sort of detour before you even get to your destination. You know, I haven't used it at all at the moment. And it don't even go to Cheddar, by the way. It drops you right on the outskirts at the Magic Roundabout, which is a peculiar type of junction as you, before, uh, as you leave Axbridge and you go towards Cheddar and, or you go the other way to Shippen. It's called the Magic Roundabout. And apparently that bus will drop you there. It won't take you into Cheddar. See what I mean? And there are lots of people 
with resumer frames, walking sticks, um, wheelchairs, who now cannot use the bus service, even though they've got bus passes. It's denying a whole group. It's like me. I, I actually feel deprived that I've not been able to go to Cheddar or Wells easily anymore. You've got to try and link up with another one of these crazy bus services. They're like 16 seaters and they don't have a regular bus stop and you do, it just seems really ridiculous to me. I've had to find other ways. I tried, well I did, I walked to Cheddar from Winscombe and back and it was knackering. I, there was no way, because when I used to go to Cheddar, I used to get up on the hill straight after, very close to getting off the bus where I had all my early energy. And I would come back at the end of the day downhill to Cheddar to pick up my bus. Um, and even when I had my van, I, most of the time I still used the bus service. It saved on petrol. I know I used to moan about it a bit. When it was late, when it didn't turn up. It near, that's, the 126 would always be a last bus. You would get picked up, even if you had to wait another hour. They always picked up everybody. And you felt that you, you won't be left. I'm not quite so sure with these ones. That seemed to break down all the time. They don't run regular. They, they miss, they have the huge gaps between buses. Sometimes three hours. You'd have to wait for the next bus. And they only take you out to the very minor villages, which is, is good. It still is good that Rington has got a bus service. But Cheddar to Western, no. Anyway, folks, that's enough of me moaning, but I like to put it on record. That's what my walks are about. They're reflective journals and visual diaries. And what I'm saying, the reason I brought it up is because I, this is very special for me to get out there. I've had to work out different ways of getting out here now. Knowing I can't walk to Cheddar, there will be no bus. I can go back to where I got off if I really wanted to, at the Nelson Arms at Churchill. Or I can do another good hour or so walk back to Winscombe. Or I could also do an hour, maybe two hours, if I want to walk to Congressbury and pick up a Bristol bus. And they run till late. They run till late. They run right up to 10, 11 o'clock at night. Whereas you know, the last bus leaving from Rington to Winscombe is very early. In fact, the last bus will be eight minutes past six. Not from Rington, from, from uh, Winscombe. Leaves obviously even earlier from Rington. There is no evening service. There was once an evening service for Cheddar. There used to be one up till eight o'clock and that was brilliant. Especially in the summer, you could do, plan your day differently. No. Nope. Right, I'm gonna get back to the walk now. I'm just gonna turn off and then coming back on. This will be much more of a bus moaning section which I might leave out but I will save it over and out a minute